Okay, today on the junkyard metal pushers, we've got a thing called the reverse curve. The reverse curve is what you're going to need on these British sports car where you get a dip like this off, coming off the round fender, and it's going to dip through here and come up and, uh, no, I didn't mean the fender, cow, and then it comes up and meets the, the, uh, the fender here. So then you've got a curve this way, and you got a curve that way. There's also one more curve on this car, and that's a curve going this way, out towards the, the windshield post. There, you got three curves here. You got one going up and down, one going uh, convex, and you got one third one going out towards the from the front of the car, going back towards the driver's door out there. So. What you're gonna do, I'm gonna show you what I did, and I watched this on a Lazy Metal Shaping. Watch his his uh, videos, and and uh, man, the guy's good. So what you got here is you've got a, a frame down the center. That means don't touch that. Do not touch that with the wheel, unless you want to lose some of your shape. So on this outside edge here and here, I roll it. I don't have a plenishing hammer. They work really well for this kind of stuff because they work with the elasticity of the metal. Listen to me with the big words. And uh, so anyway, I just wheel this, English wheel, this outside edge, and it gives me this curve that you see here. Lifting up, touching at each end, and lifting up. That's about, God, I don't know, like a couple, uh, two inches. So then later on, if you want to, you can go turn the panel upside down. And you can run it through the wheel like that and with a really round radius in there to match the, 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 the shape that you've got in the panel then you're gonna lose some of your arc and you don't want to do that but anyway you can do that if you want to but uh, you can wheel this back and forth and it will lift up and uh and it will give you that reverse curve and it is okay like i was saying it is okay to to work your wheel in a corner like that you can have a curve to the way that you're working okay so that's it for today um yeah i got other stuff to do okay bye